I graduated from UT Knoxville, the only UT. I should not say that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, my degree is in political science and global studies. When I graduated, it was really kind of a whirlwind. I ended up um, graduating sooner than I thought I was going to. It's kind of embarrassing to say, hey, I'm Sarah, I'm 23, and I live with my parents. But it's, um, I can't complain, it's a cheap place to stay, so I'm able to save money and uh, kind of get on my feet and work a little harder at saving money and finding a, a real job. Um, right now, I am working as a receptionist slash legal assistant, and that's really just for my own benefit, <laughs> um, at a law firm. It's a family law firm. And so we do mostly divorce and child custody. Two years? <laughs> um, two years, I'm really hoping to be not in Memphis, first of all, not working at a law firm. I thought initially maybe I would want to be a lawyer. I thought, oh, maybe this would be a good one. Maybe I'll go to law school. And having worked here, I decided that's not what I want to do. Um, but... I think in two years, hopefully I'll be living in D.C. and working for maybe a nonprofit or um, at least getting my toes wet and moving in the right direction towards a career in the Foreign Service. I have been through so many different what do you want to be when you grow up. At one point, I wanted to be a lawyer. At one point, I wanted to be a fighter pilot, just like Dad. Um, I wanted to be a singer, I know for sure, because it was always kind of embarrassing saying that when you have a lisp. So, um, I think ultimately, I've decided that the what I wanted to do was help people, as cheesy as that sounds. I'm really goofy, to the point where it's embarrassing most times. Um, but I'd say endearing as well. I obviously love cats. As a receptionist, I'm supposed to be happy all the time. I am inviting, I'm engaging. And I know that these people are going through terrible times in their lives. And if I'm somebody who's helping them or showing them just a little bit of kindness... I know that it makes a difference in their lives. So that's what gets me through the day. I'm meant for something more. I'm not I'm not one of those people that's going to be able to just sit at a desk all day long, punch numbers, and be okay with it. 